uproar in East Ridge tonight after the resignation of their city manager. Well, today we've uncovered surprising turnover numbers in the history of city managers over the last 20 years. News Channel 9's Jerry Askin went searching for answers about the high turnover in the city. He's back now with reaction from the city and taxpayers. Jerry. Well, Kim Latricia, Tim Gobble officially resigned yesterday. You may recall in December he employed his 19-year-old church friend. Then two months ago, the city council booted John Anderson as their city attorney. The city now has seen several city managers, and many residents aren't so happy. Tim Gobble wasn't home today after we went by his house looking to find out why he resigned. But we found out over the past 20 years, Easteridge has seen a total of eight city managers, some serving only two months in office. The longest served only five years. And they should be settled with, with someone for a long time. This doesn't make sense. You guys will come in, uh, do the dirty work, uh, get caught, and then leave with a settlement. And uh, it's just wrong. And today, residents are in shock to find out, according to Gobble's resignation agreement, he'll still get his base salary and health benefits for seven months, costing city taxpayers $72,000. Because he's not doing the job till then, is he? Mm -hmm. No, it's because he's not working. If someone else does wrong on a job, they get fired. They don't get a paycheck. Many now question how the city will stay afloat and who will take over. And today we found out Eddie Phillips will serve as the interim city manager until they find a new one. And on Monday, city council will meet here to discuss hiring a new city manager. We interviewed deputy city manager Eddie Phillips at last night's city council meeting. He's confident the city will move forward. City's weathered a lot of storms and we'll weather this one. Uh, everybody's you know in it together, and we will. Uh, I feel like uh, I feel like we'll. Be fine. Again, a meeting is scheduled for Monday at 6 p.m. to discuss hiring a new city manager. We'll let you all know when they find one. Latricia. All right, Jerry. Thank